sculptured through its complex simplicity, the rarity of its articulate elegance, constants running through its core, framing fields, yielding a whole new level to our understanding, unspooling into infinity, carrying threads of our wonderful reality. Hello everyone and welcome to yet another edition of Formula Friday. So I hope you all are well and um, apologies in advance for the really short poem. Um, what I wanted to do was to encapsulate the beauty and simplicity and the succinct nature that Euler's identity has, which is the subject of the poem this week. And it's been hailed as one of the most beautiful, if not the most beautiful formula because of the way it leads you in with its simplicity at first, but then you see how many of the mathematical constants are included in the equation and how just the building blocks and the way it's been put together influence so many different fields. So I feel very um, underqualified to talk to you about Euler's identity for anything more than a little video, but I will include some links down below so you can peruse them at your own leisure. There are also many articles on how Euler's identity kind of crops up in popular culture. So it's a really interesting read in general, really, for all the sets of information that I'll include. Um, so uh, apologies again for the brevity of this video. I hope you did enjoy it. And if you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. I do look forward to any feedback you may have. And if you'd like to subscribe, I do this series every Friday for this month. So it's called Formula Friday. And I also do science poetry every Thursday called Verse Day, which is when I take a specific news story to do in the science fields for that particular week and I write a poem about it and I read it um, every Thursday. So um, yeah, if you'd like to subscribe, you can always click it down here. And yes, thank you so much again for taking the time to listen. I hope you all have a wonderful weekend and I will see you on Thursday for Verse Day. So, signing off and...